So what are some inspirational life lessons that you can apply to yourself? Well, in this video, I'm going over a very few important life lessons you can apply for a happier life coming up. Hey, if we haven't met before, my name is Johan, and on this channel, you'll find helpful discussional topics to improve your self-care, as well as tips and strategy videos just like this one. So if you're new here, consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell. Also too, at any point in the video, make sure you check out the links and the show notes in the video description about today's topic. Okay, let's get started. Diving into the first one, you're living a life that you created. Understand this, you create your own life. Think about it. No one is holding a gun to you and tell you that you have to choose between the red pill or the blue pill, right? I mean, unless you put yourself in that predicament, but you know what I mean. I should have I used a different example. Let's say you wanted to lose weight or learn a new language by a certain time. Based on your actions can determine your outcome. If you don't put in time towards a mission, how else would you expect to get shit done? Second, avoid asking, what if? What if? What if I took that job opportunity? What if I didn't hesitate to go on stage to show the whole crowd my secret talent? What if I can't produce the best results in my project? Hey, stop it, stop it. Asking what if will send you to a place that you do not wanna go. You don't need to go. There are so many scenarios you can use with that phrase, what if, right? So if you're asking yourself what if, Ask yourself, is this something that I really want or something I really want to do? Lesson number three, don't say yes unless you really want to. So in the video, how to stay focused in life, I talk about the five buckets of priorities. You can actually check out that video after you check out this one because at least you'll know what I'm saying. So yeah. Anyways, I mentioned about the power of saying no. The fact that every time you say yes to something, you're saying no to your own dreams. Building from what I just said, the next life lesson to learn is Confidence comes first. I'm pretty sure you hear this all the time, but the saying confidence is key. It's like a building block of all human things in life, if you will. If you have an idea, if you wanna make a proposal, if you want something in life, just say it. Say it, speak it out, hello world. This is what I want. This is what I'm gonna get. I am gonna work for it. Where I was going with this? Say it with confidence. I believe we should go with plan A instead of going with plan B. I wanna make a difference in my life. Will you marry me? No. Say it with confidence. Will you marry me? <laughs> Numero cinco. You're only good as the people you associate yourself with. This is something I constantly tell people time and time and time again, and it's really true. If you surround yourself with losers, guess what? You're gonna end up being a loser. Right? You surround yourself with people who are smart, guess what? You're gonna feed off that smartness and you'll become smart too as well. You see, the thing is, when you surround yourself with people, their auras, their viewpoints, everything kind of slowly rub off on you and you slowly become that person. You surround yourself with hustlers, guess what? You're gonna end up being a hustler. You're gonna surround yourself with people that gossip, guess what? You're gonna be one of those people that'll be gossiping. If you're surrounding yourself with people that's doing nothing constructive and all they're doing is talk, 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 like a parrot ass. I highly advise that you surround yourself with people that can uplift you and help you level up. Doing this won't allow you to be very toxic or very uninspired. If you're the smartest person in the room, I think you should go to a room where a lot of people are smarter than you. Over a very few important life like okay. Bam. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Okay, so diving into the first one. You're living in a life, you're living a life. I had to hold my phone because I didn't want to slap it off the, the damn holder. You know, we ain't about that life. Will you marry me? 